excited for me. Uh, they knew how much uh, football meant to me, and, and to get the chance to uh, to be drafted uh, in the spot I did and, and be able to play in the place that I'm playing at is it, it means more to all of them. Tell me about the team you were joining. Uh, Cleveland Browns. Uh, on the visit there, I kind of got a, took a ride, and, and uh, a guy was kind of explaining to me the city and the, and the history of the team and, and how much uh, football means to those fans. Um, like I said, uh, I'm, I came from uh, LSU. We obviously had a, a great tradition uh, uh, in Lowell fans there, and that's exactly what I'm going into. So it's, it's just great all around. What is your expectation from your team? What do you Are you confident to be a star player? Uh, I know it's going to take work. I, I'm, I'm, I'm confident that I'm going to go in and work hard and, and, and go prove myself and, and uh, earn the respect of those older guys and, and hopefully get a spot on that team. You're going to be a globally known from now on. How do you feel about that? The whole world's going to be watching you. It feels great. <laughs> <laughs> Could you tell any message to international fans, like Japanese fans? They're getting a lot of fans from your team. Oh, really? Um, I had no idea, but that's, 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 that's great. So, uh, tell me, Barkidis, do, do you think um, you can have an impact on the first year? Uh, I definitely think so. Uh, the way the... The way that I play the game, uh, I, I think I can uh, impact early on. Um, and my intention to go in week one of the game and, and fight for a job. What are you most excited about going into the game specifically? Uh, just the fans. Like I said, um, I obviously came from LSU. Uh, we had a loyal fan base. Uh, we pack the stadium every week. Um, they're the same way. They have fans that, that build their game religiously and, and they love to see their, their team win. Is there anybody on the team you're excited to play with? Um, well, uh, have to hit uh, Trent Richardson uh, in college. Uh, now I'm kind of happy that I get to watch other people uh, get hit by him. So, any player you're looking forward to playing against? Uh, it's a quarterback league. Uh, I'm looking forward to to being able to uh, to hit all those uh, well-known quarterbacks and say, uh, you know, I, I did it. Like know? Roethlisberger, perhaps? Uh, Roethlisberger, any of them. You know, <laughs> might call anybody out. <laughs> You played in the SEC. How do you think the speed of that conference has helped compare to the NFL? Well, I think um, we're playing against uh, some of the best talent uh, in the country uh, week in and week out. And, and um, just being able to play in that conference, uh, it prepares us uh, greatly for what we're about to uh, encounter uh, on the next level. How do you think the transition will be to go over to Cleveland? I was definitely going to be a transition. It's obviously, uh, uh, from a climate stand standpoint, uh, very different. Um, but football's football. Um, I'm just ready to go play. Do you think anybody's going to do anything with the dog pound in your first name? <laughs> Somebody brought that up earlier. I, I can see where it might happen. Uh, <laughs> okay. That's just this idea. Let's see what they got. Okay. What do you think will be the biggest challenge for you in your transition to the NFL? Um, just uh, being able to, to grasp the playbook fully, I guess. I, I know they're, uh, it's uh, obviously bigger than what, uh, what I have to deal with in, at uh, LSU. Uh, but... Uh, Ready for the challenge. I'm excited to play. Uh, just can't wait to get to Cleveland and, and uh, get my foot in the door and get started. Hey, look into the camera and give the Cleveland Browns fans a message. This is Barkevius Mingo, and I'll be there tomorrow. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, <man. laughs>